So on a previous episode of House Smarts, we took a house and we filled it full of compact fluorescent light bulbs to see how much money the homeowners could actually save. Well, there's an emerging technology now that's becoming more available with LED lighting. So we're in another house today, actually the home of Helen Satsos. Thanks for joining us. Hey, Lou. Thanks for letting us come in here and, and being part of our little experiment. Now, you have a lot of different styles of lights in your home. Uh, give me the idea of how big the home is and who actually lives here. We have about a 2,000 square foot home, three bedrooms, two baths, my husband, my two kids, and our dog, Billy Bones. I'm looking around, you got a lot of different kinds of lights here. Mm -hmm. What is the average electric bill? We spend about $105 a month, average throughout the year. Okay, what we're gonna take a, a look at is by changing to LED light bulbs, we're gonna show you how much money you could actually save. We have a home inspector outside who's taking some readings right now to be able to determine if this is investment that could pay you back. Uh, basically what we do is we do a load calculation based on the amount of bulbs in the house, the power usage, and a year or two of previous electric bills to get an average monthly cost that, they, that the homeowner will spend with and without lighting to figure out how much they actually do spend on lighting in the home. So I was introduced to LED bulbs for residential applications about five or six years ago, and I was really intrigued by the fact that these things could last so long, but at the time, they were really expensive, well over $100 a bulb. Well, they've become more affordable. What you'll see now in LED lights is down lights, like this one here, and accent light, but they're still kind of expensive, but hear me out. This particular one by Philips is the equivalent of a 40-watt down light bulb, and it only uses about seven watts of electricity. It'll last over 13 and a half years. And the cost of this bulb, around $30. So most of the LED lights you're gonna see are down lights and accent lights, but the technology is changing. Take a look at these. They actually are going to mimic the kind of light that you would get out of a standard incandescent bulb. I mean, this one almost looks like it as well. But the difference is that there's a little bit more to them, right? They'll fit in a standard lamp like that, this particular one by Evolux mimics the same type of light you'd get of a 100 watt incandescent bulb, but it only uses 13 watts. Now that's a little bit more than normal. That's because there's a little bitty fan inside this to keep the diodes cool. Now, while LEDs don't give off a lot of heat, they don't like being confined. And in order to get that light, they have to encase it in a lens, thus keeping it cool. Heat is important to make sure that these bulbs operate correctly. And this bulb costs about $80, so it is expensive. Now, speaking of heat, Justin has a little experiment to see how much heat these bulbs actually give off. Using a thermal camera, it's easy to see the difference. The incandescent bulb is well over 260 degrees, the CFL about 175 degrees, and our LED bulb about 80 degrees. All right, so we got all this information about your home, the amount of lights that you have here, and now we've got some calculations. All right, let's remind everybody what your monthly electric bill is. Every month we pay about $105. Okay, now we determined with all the lights in your home that the portion that you pay that goes to lighting is about $42. So it's about 40%. If you went to LED bulbs, that portion of your bill could go from about $42 to two to $3 a month. Seriously? Yeah, and so, the idea is that in a year, you could save anywhere from probably four to up to $500, because now you're saving so much money, you're gonna heat the lights on more. <laughs> but the, the, the idea is, even though they're expensive now, you're gonna recoup in five years, you're getting all that electricity for free. And, and really, it'd be the last time you ever replace these bulbs. That sounds great. I hate changing bulbs. Well, have fun with your LED light bulbs. Thank you very much.